Hello everyone, in this uh, video, we're still on section 7.5 and here uh, we're doing an example on the equation of a plane. So here we have to find an equation of a plane with the normal vector whose components are 2i hat, a, a j hat, negative 5 k hat and containing the point 4, negative 1 and 3. So if you guys want to visualize it, so this is the plane. So you see? This is the plane that you are given. And here, there is a normal vector, which is perpendicular to the plane, of course. And here, the point, there are two points, P1 and P2. And if you find the difference between them, which gives R minus R1. And if you dot product these two vectors, okay, so if you dot product N, the vector N, dot product with r minus r1 this has to give zero and if you commute that so here the components of n components of the vector n is a b c and here if you do this the r minus r1 so the uh, point uh, p here it's x y z and p p1 is x1 y1 z1 so if you do r minus r1 this gives us um what so this gives us sorry x minus x1 and then y minus y1 and then z minus z1 and here we have the uh, the vector n here so a b c the components of vector n now we just have to dot product them and you guys remember how to dot product like the x component along with the x and y with the y and z with the z so we, we multiply them so a times the x minus x1 and then plus b times y minus y1 and then plus c times z minus z1 equals to zero so this is simply the equation of a plane so every time you're asked to find the equation of a plane this is the formula that we're going to be using so i was just showing you if you guys want to visualize where it come from so now let's move let's do this problem okay now the equation that we just found is a x minus x1 plus b y minus y1 plus c z minus z1 equals to zero and here a b and c are simply the components of this vector n okay now we're just gonna write the components of this vector so these are 2 8 negative 5 you see here 2 8 negative 5 so 2 8 negative 5 n and what about the initial point so initial point p1 is given as 4 negative 1 3 so here the a b and c is n so we have this as a b c and this point is x1 y1 and z1 not simply plugging into the formula this formula we have a we have 2 x minus x1 plus mm, 8 8 times y minus y1 which is uh, minus y1 but it's a negative already so we write plus 1 and then plus uh, oops sorry negative 5 and 3 Z minus 3 okay now let me explain it to you guys so here it's 2 it's a so then x we write x minus x1 which is 4 and then plus 8 which is a b so write b and then y y minus y1 y1 is negative 1 but it's already in negative so we write here y negative negative 1 which gives positive so that's why i wrote positive 1 and here and here it's 5 so a c z minus z1 c is negative 5 and then z and then it's negative z1 so 
z1 is negative th is 3 so then negative 3 so this is simply the equation of this plane here you can leave it like this as well but if you want you can simplify it as well so let's simplify it simplifying gives 2x negative 8 plus 8y plus 8 then negative 5z plus 15 equals to 0 and then we have here negative 8 and 8 cancels out so we have 2x plus 8y negative 5z plus 15 plus 15 equal to 0 so the simplified answer can also be written as, as this okay so that's it the answer thanks for watching bye